What's up guys, Marco Flores here with Nern the Bay. We're checking out a game called Karate Do. A little fancy song going on first. So we got a tutorial section here. You're gonna tap the right side of the screen, you're gonna move forward. And I guess the green indication is when you can strike. So you tap on the right side of the screen again. And then it says in terms of distance, Red means it's not a good time to strike. Or, or red is in, it red indication means like it's not a good time to strike. While the green is an indication where it is a good time to strike on your side, but your opponent can also strike. All right, so we're getting some movement going. Yeah, this, the indication is is going red, red and green, so. It gives you a clear, clear explanation when and when and when you cannot strike or move forward. I'm actually surprised there is actually a story here. So we're going up against like a five-time world champion. I don't know if they're they're like a hybrid of Bruce Lee and Chuck Norris. Probably, probably so. But essentially, what this is is like a a karate point fighting game where it's not so much of like you're fighting continuously, but like you're attacking to get points. But this also is like continuous sparring at the same time. It's, it's a little weird to ex explain. In continuous sparring, you're fighting until either your opponent is down or the round is up. In this one, it's semi-continuous sparring, but you're collecting points. But anyways... I get to, <laughs> off that little tangent, I get to pick my name, and I pick the country, of course. Looking for the U.S., but it wasn't, I'm so used to, for the U.S. being on top, like, all the way up to the top of the, the scrolling uh, menu. Not used to it being, like, all the way in the bottom, considering, but oh well, that's fine. I like the artwork uh, of this game. Uh, it's pretty, it's pretty simple, and it makes the, like, the animations are... The animations are pretty good. I like them from what I'm seeing so far. Like, you know, it's it's, it's a little budget, but, you know, there's a charm to it. So here you get to select the, the type of warrior or type of character you have. One's strength, one's speed, and one's range. Um, range is pretty, pretty good to consider because since you're going back and forth, trying to get in range to attack and maybe get out of range to, um, you know, avoid, avoid getting it hit so that is actually pretty good pretty good to consider while strength i'm not so sure unless there are knockdowns in this game i'm not entirely sure yet um don't know if that's actually a deciding factor speed probably helps a little bit more so for the points but it's pretty much a simple concept you're just you're tapping the left and right side of the screens you're get, trying to get in range and try to get your points um there are all it is also introduces um like counter attacking so when you like you do defend su successfully um you have a chance to counter counter attack uh counter attack sorry uh immediately uh while the opponent is not ready for like is basically recovering their attack so you're actually thinking about like not so much of counting frames in like a fighting game but like there's recovery once out your you finish your attack, whether it's successful or not. So I guess the uh, the end score is ten. Like if somebody gets ten points, no matter what the the match ends. So ten to two, not too bad. I still have a beginner guy, so like I'm not super powerful or anything. Uh, let's see what we get out of this box. Let's see, spark. Fire feet, okay. More spark. So I guess spark is like elements in terms of um, in terms of customizing your customizing your character. But if we're going back to the whole strength, speed, and range, then I guess color coordinating the elements of what they give you probably means like you're probably going to be upgrading to that like range or speed or strength. All right. So, let's get into this game uh, fight. I'm doing not too bad. I'm um, still trying to get used to it. See, as you can see, there's the guy was trying to 
counterattack. So when you do a successful successful uh, block, you'll see that blue like animation, and then you can you're ready to attack right away. You also see that animation, that blue animation, when you're dashing forward. All right, getting like some blue energy going. It's trying to be cautious. Both of us are trying to be cautious, and there's a timer up in the top, as you can see. And then the rotating wheel is like the attacks that I guess it's ready for. So like that, those are your attacks. So when you're in range, I guess it selects the type of attack that you're gonna do. So we got some, you know, more elements. Let's see if we can is there, let's see if we can upgrade. Oh no, we're going straight to another fight. This guy, this guy has green gloves and red uh, feet. All right, you got me on a counter attack there. So this guy's pretty good on defending. I'm already down two zero three zero now. All right, I gotta think of something. He's he's definitely getting in while I'm trying to get in range. He's getting in on me. And then the bottom is basically di uh, distance, uh, where right side is your opponent's like distance, like opponent's side, and you know blue blue is my side. So like I'm trying to cover his his side so he has like pretty much like nowhere to go so he's I'm trying to corner him basically but this guy's getting me nine zero nine three one more point and he's done okay time's up he still wins though but I didn't do so do so well all right first loss it's okay martial arts you uh, learn to fall and then you learn from your falling so Leaf, Spark, Diamond. Diamond premi is premium currency, of course. I think the blue one's water. We're, we're going by icons. And here you're able to customize and um, upgrade your abilities, uh, specifically your attacks. Yeah, so strength, speed, and range. And I get to choose which attacks that I would like to. Uh, I would like to upgrade on the preview you can see the actual tax it itself see what it what it basically covers so that one's like the first the first one was like a uh, a lead jab other ones like a re reverse punch or a cross strength speed and range so let's see so if you have enough sir say spark then you can upgrade it to that level But I believe you can balance out all of the attacks. So you do, I guess you do want to, maybe you just do want to max it out. Unless you get like better attacks along the way. Which I, I have yet to get to. So I'm still, at the end of this video, I am still at the like the base, like, number of attacks. So that's what you're seeing right now. And then you also get equipment. I got fire feet. Uh, I don't know if, the, <laughs> I don't know if essentially that it's actually like, it's focusing on the strength of my attacks or I actually have like fire elemental feet I don't know a little weird but it's okay Let's see shop unlocks and yellow belt so are you gonna be doing essentially what you're gonna be doing is you're gonna be getting into a lot of fights um, just trying to get your wins getting gear getting um, like elements element uh, like upgrades and such just so you can upgrade your character and your and your abilities, your techniques. And then once you eventually unlock that store and then like, you know, more flexibility. If you want to buy stuff, that's up to you. Let's see. Four points to one, which is pretty good. I believe this is I'm not sure if this is just an online only game, because I you may be just fighting other people. I may be just still in the tutorial section. Cause, cause if it's a versus, then I would, I, I would feel like I would see like you know I'm going up against so and so name, like from, like another country or something. All right. I do kind of wish that I was able to change the name rather than have like a, a stock character, name. But oh well, it's fine. Cause you know you want to make your character your own. Alright, 
see. 2-0 is a pretty good match. He has range hand no speed hands and fire feet. I'm looking by the looking by the colors of the character. Well, I just have like fire feet. Ooh. See it's it gets pretty uh intense as you're trying to close in distance and avoid strikes. So you get sort of a fencing thing going. But like I said, is this is like semi continuous sparring. Uh you're gathering points um but you're not really going for the knockout. I'm not I haven't seen a knockout yet, but that may be a possibility, who knows. Got a I got a chest, so I get to unlock that. Those chests are on a timer, so you can uh, get a bunch of chests. Like I, I could think the maximum is four. And then just wait for your timers to go down. I actually like that there's a little bit of a story. Like I said, I was surprised that there was a, some sort of story here. But it is your path, your journey to... On your way to get a... Well, one, get a black belt and, you know, be the best, I guess. Best around. So this guy is pretty cool. He's a boss, apparently. And uh, you can see he has a, a customized gi, he has a customized hands. I think he's a gold belt or a yellow belt. I'm not so sure. But he's pretty unique. Rather than where I'm just, you know, wearing all white. Because, you know, you're white, you're a beginner. But, yeah. Alright, well. Let's see. He's well, he's up on me. three, uh, Six now. Six, three. I have 17, 16, 15 seconds left to catch up he's pretty good he's good on defense and he's getting trying to getting he's trying to get me on the counters okay catching up seven to seven five seconds left good defense oh he got me eight er okay well he got me that round so i guess in boss levels you have rounds so i do need to make sure i win this round Let's see and then I, I think eventually, as you like progress through the game and get unique attacks, then you can equip and equip like you, the types of, of attacks that you want, and then you essentially have your own character right from there. But I wish I was able to just change the name or something, even though he was asking me for my name. That was weird. Six one, so he's not. He's pretty down on this one, unless he catches up for some whatever reason. Seven, seven, one, seven, two now. Okay. Ten seconds, unless he can hit a, a chain of attacks. I think I'm gonna win this round. Eight, four, three seconds left. Oh, he's catching up now. Five. There you go. Time's up. I won that round. So he won one. I won one. So we're at the bonus round to like determine it all. He got me. All right. I got him. I do like I do like this uh, this type of uh, karate sparring game because you know essentially the fighting games now um, they're pretty much the same not as unique as back in the day when uh, I think like karate came out for like the arcade and maybe Atari but uh, yeah I I remember the karate games coming out in like the arcade games and uh, Nintendo per se so. This kind of like throws it back to like what it was back then, which is pretty cool. You know, point fighting such. Alright, five seconds. I think I'm going to win this one. Unless he can... Okay, good, good. So essentially I won the fight. And a little bit of a less experience. It's kind of cool that it's in like comic book fashion. I like that. Oh, when I get my yellow belt. What? All right, there you go. We're progressing. Victory. I won two rounds out of th out of three, and I get some stuff. And a lot of the stuff is more unlocked. So, I'm gonna back out and see what is able to was what is able to be unlocked. I think store was unlocked, and then I get my yellow belt and some gear. I think I have like hands now. I'm gonna catch these hands. Uh, let's see. Yep, fire hands. Bind unequipped. They got like little MMO uh, terminology going. All right. Yeah. There you go. Looking looking a little better. 
So I need to get my elements to be able to upgrade my techniques, which that's going to be basically the grinding part of it. Let's see. Oh, I still have the same techniques. I hope to unlock some more. That'd be pretty cool. Alright, well that about does it for Karate Do. It's a pretty cool game. It just basically released. Uh, guys, let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. As always, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and we'll see you guys next time on the next video. Alright, peace guys.